So today I have to get ready for a really complicated thing. It's our annual upfronts, which is when all um, our advertisers and people from the industry and media and agencies come and listen to us talk about everything we've done this year and everything we're going to do next year. So it's kind of like our, I don't know, it's just a big deal. And last night was in Sydney and I wore this dress, which I love. It's a dress from um, Ginger and Smart. And I wore it with this velvet jacket from Baz Inc. Um, and Shazzy Hunt, who works at Mamma Mia, was wearing the exact same dress. And we both bought, bought it for a wedding. But Melbourne's different, not least but, uh, because of the fact that I've got to drop, don't have to drive there, I've got to fly there, literally flying down for the day not packing any luggage. So I've got to be comfortable. I've got to like walk a lot and I've got hours, you know, airports and stuff. So I have no idea what I'm going to wear. I start with one piece and then build an outfit around it. It's a sequin skirt, but it almost doesn't look like sequins. It just almost looks like shimmer. It's kind of mermaidy. So I could just wear something really plain with it, like a plain white shirt. I also just feel like then what would I do? I'd be cold. It's not quite right. Now I could do more sequins, but this color's not right. No. Bingo. Because it's a t-shirt, it sort of dresses down the skirt and this is kind of a bit rock and roll, so this doesn't feel too pretty. But then the key is what do I put over it? And I think I'm gonna go for something you would never expect. A black jacket. Who would have thought I would have put a black jacket on? Something I really like at the moment about black jackets over like pretty dresses and things that are really feminine just gives it a bit of a cooler harder edge but then what shoes do I wear they have to be flat and comfortable because I'm going to be in airports so this goes with this like the skirt the gold picks up the skirt but because I'm wearing the black jacket so that I don't just look like I'm wearing my boyfriend's jacket I think I need black boots to anchor it I think this is it look the dogs aren't impressed. I think the black boots kind of anchor it. Maybe they don't. I think they do though. My other option, if I don't know, I think this is it. Mm. Oh, I don't know now. This is just a different black jacket, but it's just a little more kind of cash. Now I'm rethinking the sequin t-shirt. Maybe I just need something plainer. Shit. Okay, I've ended up with something quite different. I've ended up with a different skirt, a different top. The boots are still here and I think I'll still wear a black jacket. And I think it'll be this one. Should it be this one or maybe the other one? This jacket, because my dog's in the way. This jacket, because it's kind of more structured in its shape. I'm just wearing like a long sleeve t-shirt with this see-through shimmery thing on the top. I hope I'm happy with that. I think I'm happy with that. Ready to go. God, that was a journey, wasn't it? Very intense. Got there though. When I turned off the camera, I went, I'm not done yet. So <laughs> the top wasn't right. It wasn't sitting here right. It looked, just didn't work. So I've got this top on, it's from Baz Inc. I love it. And I just have to work out, the shoes were looking too heavy. I've got to work out which shoe. These ones or these ones? I think blue. Okay, absolutely nothing matches. And yet I feel good. We got there. That's how my mind works. Complicated.